Hello today, and today we're going to have a game of Tank for the Amstrad CPC. This is a game I've never played before. I was just once again browsing through my ROMs and just curious to see what this is about. Just maybe it might be one of them ones like an early Worms type game where you're in tanks and you just fire on the landscape. But it's not, because I've had a test run of it. It's nothing like that at all. Right. Um, so let's refund our. <laughs> excuse me. Let's refund our keys. Right. Fire will have space. Q, A, right, P, and O. And then we got um, turret left and right. So we just maybe have the, this key, that key, and enter. <coughs> As I said, I had a test run. You don't really need to use those additional to turn a turret because you can turn your tank anyway. Um, so let's just play the game. Here we are. So in our tank. So basically, it's like um, a well, a commando game, except for you're not a soldier. You're driving a tank instead. So you've got to follow the arrows and destroy the enemy. the enemy as well yeah so yeah graphically well, it's nice and colorful I suppose you've got to remember this came out in 1985 so one I've never heard of reminds me a little bit of um, there's a game by Codemasters is it Super Tank Simulator I had I think I played that it was on the Commodore 64 Played that reminds me a little bit like that. Oh, bollocks, game over already. Didn't do very well, did I? Ocean Software. Okay, that's a surprise. It's more obviously being Ocean Software, you'll have to put you would probably have to pay um, about five pounds, six pounds, maybe full price. I don't know, but I would have been a little bit ripped off if I paid 9 99 for this. They could have been like mid-range price. So, I mean, there's no license, movie license, or arcade time with nothing. So it'd probably been a mid, a mid-priced game. But it does does to me look like a budget game. That's what it really should be—a budget game. So, all right. So that only fires up if you push. Um, fire on the turret, so that's weird. Oh, of course it would, because the turrets only stand in one position at all times. So what I said about turning the tank is a load of crap, because the turret always positioned until you move, move the move the turret. It's a bit weird. It'd be it'd be nice to um, have the turret going where your tank's going. It'd be easier that way. So moving the tank. Oh bollocks! Moving the turret um, separately. But there you go. Ah, oh, bloody hell, game over already. Have another go. Let's give it a chance. Yeah, I probably would have played this back in the day. You bastard, how could a soldier shoot a tank? So it looks like you get maybe three lives in this game. Yeah, commando, instead of soldier, you're driving a tank. I mean, if you're going into battle, it makes more sense to go in something like a tank and doing commando style. But commando was a good game. You're taking nothing away from commando. I mean, this is all right. Oh, you get an energy meter. Ah, look, there's an energy meter. I didn't just saw that. Oh, that bloody took a lot of energy off. Bloody hell. Let's have another go. Let's have another, yeah. It seems like I'm dying in the same, same plot, spot. Bloody hell. What did he do? Throw a grenade launcher at me. So, L. L M E. what's that, energy? That's probably represent energy. L is probably, I don't know. U, V, whatever that is. I 
So your machine gun, oh bollocks, when you push space bolt, it's obviously your machine gun, that um, obviously goes in the direction your tank goes, obviously if you push return, which I um, refined as my um, turret gun, that will only go in the position you um, turn your turret to, so it's always, in my case I touch my turret, so it's always facing forwards. Perhaps that might do a little bit more damage, so yeah. I don't know if you're restricted to how many you get and it's game over at the same point again. Bloody hell. Anyway, I'm gonna leave it now. Um yeah, it's an alright game. Um if you haven't played it, maybe it's worth checking out. If you sort of like if you like commando style games, give it a go because you're driving a tank. <laughs> Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, and goodbye.